Hi everybody, this is Mike from Prodigy and today I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a free parent account. With a free parent account, you'll be able to link your child's player account to it and from there monitor their math progress as they play Prodigy. You'll also be able to change their grade level and manage their account settings such as passwords and memberships. Now you don't have to be a parent to create an account, so if you're a grandparent or guardian who is overseeing a child's use of Prodigy, that's perfectly okay. If you already purchased a membership to Prodigy for your child previously or have a current membership, then you already have a parent account created for you at the time of purchase automatically. It would have been registered under the email address you entered at the time of purchase. You can recover your password by visiting our homepage at prodigygame.com and clicking where it says log in and then selecting I forgot my password. Okay, so if you haven't already registered, let's get started from our homepage at prodigygame.com, clicking where it says get your free account. Make sure you highlight parent at the top of the box that appears, and then enter your name, your email address, and the password that you would like to use. If you'd rather set up your account to log in with Google each time, you can do so by selecting sign up with Google. Once your account is created, you'll be reminded that you can track your child's progress and see the number of questions they answer each week. Click Next and you can set your location from the drop-down menu. From there, you can opt into receiving further emails about your child's progress. The next step will allow you to either link your child's existing account to your parent account or create a new account for them if they don't already have one. If they have an account they use at school, this is where you will link it as an existing account so you can follow their progress. Let's choose that option. Enter your child's existing username and their password. Their username is the first part of their login they use to log into the game. Once done, click Add Child. If they don't have a username and password, and they use a Google account to log into the game, then you will click where it says Add with Google. If you choose that option, and if you are currently logged in with your own Google account, you will need to log out of your Google account and log into your child's Google account to add them. A cool new feature of parent accounts is the ability to set goals for your child and reward them with an in-game item when they accomplish their goal. You'll get to try this out right away upon adding your child for the first time. You can set the amount of correct questions they need to answer in the game in order to receive their reward item. Once you have set the number of questions, click Set Goal and then choose to continue. Your child's account is now linked to your parent account. You'll be able to set further goals for them, monitor their progress, and change their account settings. For further information about these features, be sure to check out our other videos or visit our support website. Thanks for watching.